Because look over here, Jake. Would who? Yeah, because that had to be picked up. And it's and, and, and it's pushed this way. Text text broke yeah, out. Text did it. Text come back for though. That's so weird. Text broke out and then came back because Moses was not worth his time. Oh, oh my back. god, y'all. That's horrible. Oh my god. Tex has walked over, stolen one of the ladies, and brought her back. And Santana won't even look. Oh boy, she's looking now. Well, what have we here? I am coming out for my morning feed up. And look who's waiting. Look who is sitting here waiting by the fence, wondering if they will also be getting a little bit of a morning feed up, a little morning snack. Boy, Pop Paul knew just what he was doing by putting y'all in here. So you can see the little one's going crazy. She's getting her morning feed up. But uh, Billy, and his sweet little lady friend there also want a morning feed up. How's the water situation? Isn't this strange? I wonder why one would be completely empty and the other one would still be full. I wonder why they prefer one water over the other one. That's strange. But I will empty and fill both of those up. Both these, though, you're both looking really good on flies or no flies. Oh, Billy, but you need a bath, buddy. You need a bath, Billy. All right, let me get y'all a little morning snack here. All right, these two goofballs are going to share out of the exact same pile when I put two piles on the ground. Hey, well, look at you. What do you think you're doing? I see, oh boy. Oh, that's not mama. Do not. Man, look at her eye. Look how dangerous that is. Billy's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna push her away. Watch your eye, please. Look at, oh my God. Did y'all see how close that was? Hey, sweet girl, listen. Back up. There's another thing of feed right here behind you. See, the thing is, they're going to, oh, her eye. Billy, you're going to hurt her. All right, these guys are good. Wait a minute. What am I seeing back there? What am I looking at here? That's not Tex. Jake, that's not Tex back there. There's someone in the pasture with Tex. You see what I see? even look this way. Gracie is. Gracie's like, Daddy, don't do it, Daddy. Texas like, hey, I'm not. So, what do you think you're doing over here? Huh? Did you hear we give good snacks? Did you hear that we have really good snacks over here? Oh, we need a brush down. We need some spray and some brush and spray and wipe, they call it. We need some spray and wipe here. All right, let me take care of that real fast. Uh, guys, we got a lot going on. Let's go see what, let's, what happened over here. Okay, so let me, hold on, let me turn this off. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, I got to. Go through some gifting goodies. 
All right, so. Somebody had to unlatch that other gate on top side and leave it open. So no one goes through there that I know of. Huh? No, yeah, no one goes through there. But that thing had to be in tide, right? That, the yellow? Oh, the yellow. Yeah, so we never had. Okay, so ours, I guess the problem with ours is the, the fact that we did it this way and not the official way. So we're going to go ahead and say right now, for everyone who's going to say something in the comments, we know the proper way. We just didn't do it the proper way. We did this the proper way. But over here, somehow they must have started pushing and shoving and got this. Jake, wait, it was pushed, it was pushed open. I mean it was pulled open. Yeah, it was that way. Was Jake. Like somebody had to hold on. Is is there any footprints over here or something? No. How bizarre. What a mystery. So this over so listen, if Tex wanted over there. When she wouldn't because those are only yearlings. He has no interest in the yearlings. None. But the gate was so the listen, this is a mystery because look, this gate, if the cow from that side would have wanted over here, it would have pushed it this way. Yet the gate was opened. But if Tex opened it, he would have been over there. But if Tex would have opened it, he would have gone over unless he went over, had a little tussle with Moses, and then came back. Because look over here, Jake. Would who? Yeah, because that had to be picked up. And it's and, and, and it's pushed this way. Text, text broke yeah, out. Text, did it, text did come back for though. That's so weird. Text broke out and then came back because Moses was not worth his time. <laughs> he went over there and stole one of his girls. Oh he my back. God, y'all, that's horrible. Oh my God. Tex has walked over, stolen one of the ladies, and brought her back. And Santana won't even look. Oh boy, she's looking now, and she is not happy. Oh, everyone's looking, Jake. This is quite the spectacle. I cannot believe she did that. Why did he choose her? He just it up to that girl. And so he busted this one down, invited her over. She walked through, and they're grazing in the pasture together. Jake, this is not good. Okay, so there's a lot. Oh, so Jake and I had just done some deductive reasoning. So this gate has been lifted because it, has, it can be lifted off the hinge. It's been lifted off the hinge, but not pushed this way. It's been lifted and pushed that way. Can we all agree on that? And then when we got over here to the second fence the gate that does not have an official latch all we would do is take this piece of wire this electrical wire is 110 wire and we would tie it and it i thought it tied a pretty good knot jake yeah, it doesn't come off very it, we wrapped it around but obviously well, let's see. someone began to push and pull now i don't know if we've always done that many knots well, but I mean, I guess if he... Oh, keep going, Jake. That is exactly what happened, Jake. And then, it, and then look, it closed right back to where it was sitting last time. Okay. Let's go have a peek at Moses and see if he's okay. Yeah, really. Jake, can you believe this? And why would Tex... Oh, boy. Oh, no. <laughs> Tex is sitting. Oh. He's wondering if anyone else wants to come over. He's trying to tell them that he gets food every day. Uh, what happened here yesterday? I know I fed up last night. I fed up last night. Okay, what, ha what, what went on here through the midnight hours? Moses, you okay? Jake, look at Moses' butt. Okay, so guys, this is something that, okay, I'm not trying to be gross here. But the, yes, so Tex and Moses have been wrestling. Jake, it's the uh, the it's the runny stuff. Okay. Okay. So everyone knows. Okay, I, man, I hate to say this. This is just gonna probably ruin this entire video for a lot of people. But you've all seen the videos of Tex when he gets in with Billy, and Billy he gets the runs immediately. Cut off Billy. 
We ain't doing this, Billy. Go, Billy. Billy, look out, Jake. Don't do that. Look out, Jake. This is the kind of thing that terrifies you as a parent. But at the same time, you're happy to give the kids the experience for whenever you're not going to be here with them. All right, so you don't get between them, folks, or you're going to get yourself hurt. You let these bulls do what they're doing for the ladies. It sucks. It sucks. But you don't want to get between them because you're going to get yourself hurt. And at some point, they'll weaken themselves. They'll get tired. And when they get tired, we'll be able to run Tex back home. And so Tex must have come over, gave Moses the the runs, takes a girl, and goes back with her. And now he can't take his eyes off of her. Oh, because that was your video in Billy Pooped His Pants. Billy Pooped His Pants. Yeah. Yeah, Tex versus Billy and Billy Poops His Pants. And now this time it's kind of like Tex versus Moses and Moses poops himself. Oh no. Now a lot of these girls won't even look over there because they're still trying to be loyal to their man. They all, you know, all of us, you know, all ladies, Jake, at some point could probably have something to be ashamed of their men about, don't you think? But very few women can be loyal. And all of these girls are trying to be loyal. Now, now Moses is trying to do the face-off thing. They're trying to have a little face-off because it's important to at least, even with the poopy bottom, you still want to at least look like you got some fight in you. Okay, so, so Jake, here's the problem. What is my dad going to do when he walks out here and find one of his heifers have come over there with Tex? He's going to scream, scream, holler, cuss us out, and then I don't know what next. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's go try to feed up everybody and see if we can get this little girl back, I guess. Oh, my gosh. Tex. Oh, no. He, got, he only has eyes for her, Jake. Oh, poor Santana. All right, so our plan here is to drop out some feed for Tex, let him start eating, and then we're going to try to get her to follow us back up. Man, these guys have sit here and watched the entire debacle. Um, right, we're going to feed Tex, go ahead and get him consumed on eating. All right, try to shake it and get her to follow you. If we can get her to follow us, that'd be a lot easier. Jake, look at his barrel. He pushed his barrel under the fence. Oh my God. Boy, he was going through a bit of a rage. Uh-oh, you better go faster than that, Jake. Come on, Come on, hold on, Jake, you lost her. Tex, you can't go, buddy. Tex, you gotta stay here. Go ahead, love. Tex, you can't go, buddy. You gotta stay here. Tex, you have to stay in this pasture, buddy. This is no. You better hurry, Jake. Oh, Tex, don't be mad at me, buddy. I'm sorry. You gotta stay over here. Tex. All right, go. Oh. All right, Jake. Put her over there. Go ahead and pour some feet out far. No, sir. No, sir. Jake! Texas horns are all splintered. Oh, boy. Okay. Is that a... She does not want to be over there. She wants to be here with Tex because he's such a handsome guy. Guys, his horn has been splintered. His horn has been splintered. Tex, what did you do, buddy? His horn has been splintered. What did you do, sir? Jay, his horn's been splintered. It's been like splintered. No, sir. No, sir. You have to stay over there. All right, Jake, we're going to have to at some point come back and redo the hinges over here. Okay. Sir, you got to back up. You got you cannot mess with Moses' girls. Oh, Jake, look at him. They like Tex. He's a handsome guy. He don't poop his pants like Moses does. 
I know, Tex. Oh, Jake, it's upside down. Need help, Jake? I could probably help you and just stop videoing. No, I think I'm all right. So what we will do, it may require a little bit of work. Lift the other side, I'll do this side. Go to the other end. Raise it a little bit. Right there, down, down. So what we'll have to do is we will undo this, lower it down, flip that over, and then raise it back up, and then tighten it. It'll be real easy. Real easy, we'll need a big, probably a 5 8 I'm not sure. Well, Jake, our latch works good. Yeah, the latch didn't come undone. The oh, he's mad uh, now. We oh, go. we've made him very angry. Here we go. He's gonna storm, oh, guys, it, the, here we go. It's gonna start again. And here it starts again, Jake. All right, let's go feed these other ladies and everybody. Uh -oh. You know what, let's let everybody in, maybe they'll calm him down a little bit and not have all that ruckus. Jake, look, he likes her. He really does like her. Wonder why he picked her out of the whole group. Oh, it's kind of sad, though, now that we let her out, because he did single her out. Look at Moses trying to follow her around. Like, nope, she's my girl. Oh, it is so unfair. I better move the four-wheeler before he throws another temper tantrum. Yeah, watch it. Moses is going to say, what did he do to you? What did he do to you? And she's like, <laughs> okay, I, yeah, careful, Jake. He's not feeling very happy. Tex, you be sweet to Jake. That was real classy, Jake. That was a real classy move there. Yeah, let them all in, Jake. Yeah, I'll go up and feed. We're gonna, we'll need more feet now. Let them all in. We'll feed them up front today. Oh. Y'all, so Moses is making sure that she's, well, you know. Tex, I'm sorry. She was a pretty girl, but she's not yours, buddy. Oh, we got to take. Sorry, Tex. I know. I know. Hey, y'all be sweet. We have plenty of grains on the ground for you all. Well, here they come. All right, I'm gonna have to go up and get more grains. We already gave half of our grains away. We gave half of our grains away. Hey, y'all settle down. There's plenty to eat here. Oh man, I am afraid that we're gonna have to accelerate our Longhorn Lusters move because Tex, I just want to know what's going to happen when Santana gets over here. How she's going to react to all of this. Oh no. Can y'all hear that noise? Billy is up there screaming. Oh no. Billy's over there screaming. Oh guys, we have a we have quite the little Oh no. Oh boy, Santana's marching over here. She got Pearl and Gracie leading the way. And Santoro, this is not... Uh-oh. He's been busted, and he knows it. Busted, and he knows it. You better dig a hole and hide, boy. You better dig yourself a hole and hide. Oh, man. Well, I guess I'm happy to say that the uh, fencing that I built worked. It's the gates that we're going to have to put a little work into. Moses is trying to run her out of here. Hey, you be sweet to her. It's not her fault. He's a stud. <gasps> he is so mad at her. He's like, you little cheap hussy, floozy. And that is not the way we, f and he got his poopy pants again. Now he's pooping his pants again. Oh, oh, that's sad. We have an exile. 
That's the saddest thing I think I've seen. Everyone else is watching saying, yep, you should have been loyal. You should have been loyal. And she's like, but have you seen the horns on that guy? Have you seen the horns on that guy? Tex is just being a little horn dog. I don't know that can get me in trouble saying that, Jake, but he's just quite the horn dog right now. And Santana's not having it. She's playing hard to get because she's very upset about what he did last night and all the efforts he went through. And that is similar, Jake, to what happens in real life with humans all the time. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Men do something to when men do something and they mess they mess up. Men will mess up because we're stupid. We we are really stupid and we mess up. And then we then once we realize our mistakes, we try to make everything right. And our ladies always give us. I mean, they make us work. They make us work. And Tex is like, baby, I'm sorry. Can't you can't you tell how much I love you? She's like, not really. He's like, well, I do. Doesn't my face say everything? <laughs> Doesn't my face say everything? Can't you see it in my eyes? <laughs> and uh, she's like, uh, just go away. He goes, no, baby, please. I'm, 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 I'm right here, right now. Love me. <sighs> Santoro's like, I'm just gonna have me drink of water. I'm just gonna go drown myself. I'm just gonna go drown myself. I don't want to live this kind of misery. Don't worry, Santoro, you're gonna be the leader of a herd of a lot of ladies. And so we'll text one of these days. 